When using delegates in Unreal Engine, you might sometimes encounter the case that you want to use a return value from the function that gets called by the delegate. In that case, you have to consider a few things during the setup of the delegate itself. First, the return value can only be used by the single delegate types, so not by the multicast delegates. This makes sense since for multicast delegates you would end up having a single return value for multiple possible functions that are bound to the delegate. So with that let's look at the implementation. To add a return value to your delegate you have to add the red val keyword to the declaration of your delegate. So for example for a single delegate that does only work in C++ and has one parameter it would look like this. So the keyword for the return value comes after the delegate keyword and before the keyword that indicates the number of parameters of this delegate. Further, you can also see that you have to provide the data type of your return value as the first value of the argument list in front of the type definition of your new delegate. With that done, we can declare an instance of our delegate like this. Next, we can bind the function to the delegate, for example, using the bind lambda function. Then we have to add the lambda expression, which in our case basically multiplies the input value by itself. Now we can also create a timer and call a function inside of that that will execute our delegate. In our case, we have to provide an input value and then the exciting part, we can store the return value in its own variable. If we print the result, you will see that everything works as expected. However, if we now try to bind another function after we have bound our first function to the delegate, for example, in this case, by using bind your object and binding a function that multiplies the input value by two, then you will see that only the last bound function will be executed since this delegate type only allows one binding at a time. With that, you should be able to use return types for your custom delegates. Like always, if you have any further questions, feel free to leave them in the comments. Otherwise, don't forget to subscribe and see you next time.